Hello, fellow rock tumblers. Check this out. This is a piece of picture jasper. It's a nice chunk of picture jasper. I recently made a video where I took a big piece of picture jasper and slabbed it. Made a cabochon with one of those slabs. Well, this is left over from the initial trimming of that slab. So I thought, what could we do with this? And then it dawned on me, of course, let's throw it in a tumbler and see how smooth and shiny we can make it. The cabochon turned out pretty nice, so maybe this will be a nice polished tumbled stone. Let's find out. I'll go ahead and get this thing rolling. And once it gets nice and smooth in the coarse grid, I'll bring it back out here and show you what it looks like before moving it on to the polishing stages in the vibratory tumbler. Our little piece of picture jasper is finished with the coarse grit grinding. What do you think? This is as smooth as I'm going to get it. It's not flawless, but it's close. There's some soft areas in there which will not take much of a shine, but I'm hopeful that the rest of the stone will. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing started in the vibratory tumbler. Go for eight days with four different grits. And once it's finished, I'll bring this back in here and we'll take a closer look. The picture Jasper is finished with the polishing stages. And as you can see, it did not take a great polish. It took sort of a matte polish. You can see a little bit of reflection on there, but this stone was just a little too soft. And I remember now when I was making this stuff into a cabochon, it did not take a great shine. It has these little soft sections in it. You can see one right there. Overall, it's, a, it's an attractive rock. I, I like it, but it doesn't have that mirror shine that I'm looking for when I tumble and polish my rocks. So on that score, I'm a little disappointed. Oh well, it is what it is. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to check my other videos for more like this. Thanks again.